newly promoted Hearts are targeting a top six finish in the Scottish Premiership and are close to making two new signings. Head coach Robbie Nielsen guided the team to the Scottish Championship title last year and he's pleased with the business they've done so far this summer. I'm pleased with what we've got in so far. You know, I want to get a, at least a one in um, before the start of pre-season games. So yeah, we'll see what goes. But the, the guys we brought in are, are good quality. They've added to the squad. They've come in, they've trained really well and you know, they're definitely adding value to us. Your most recent signing, Juanma. How good do you think he can be at this level? Yeah, I think he, he'll be a good player. I know that for sure. You know how good he's going to be. He's yet to see. He's got to, got to prove himself. He's got to work hard, and he, he's got to integrate into the Scottish game as well. But you know, he's we can see already in training that he is a technically extremely good player. You know, physically strong. So you know, I don't see any problems with him you know, scoring goals. Here. Is left back now the priority to try and get get a, get a body in that position? Yeah, well, we're, you know, we're pretty far down the line where we won. So I'd like to hopefully get that done by the end of next week. Nelson was uh, with his players at a Hearts fun day at Tyne Castle. Thousands of supporters turned out for a chance to meet the players, see the championship trophy, have a bounce on the bouncy castle. <laughs> Owner Anne Budge acknowledged expectations from supporters are high and she'll continue to back Nielsen in the transfer market. We're working on another two and I would like to think we might get both of them, but certainly we're very optimistic that we'll get another one. Assuming that you do the, the business you want to, you said towards the end of last season the top six was the priority. Do you feel perhaps you could maybe even even go further than that? Well, I think I'd get my wrist slapped if I said yes to that because, uh, yes, I'd, I'd like to think we could go further than that, but uh, we have budgeted on a top six finish.